do it right now, man. Like, I, um, you know, I got a chance to make some money because I was in a dope film called Get Out, if you ain't, if you saw it. Thank y'all for going to see it. It's messed up, too, because I, I mean, for real, I've made money now, and like, my family finally done found out. Like, I've been hiding it. Like, I don't nobody know. This is how I do everything changed. One day my uncle called me like, I don't know if everybody got this. You got so like, everybody got that one person in their family that like, everybody call when you, you know, something happened and somebody's funeral need to be paid for or something like that. He called me one day, he's like, your turn, hung up. I was like, hello, excuse me, what? <laughs> Who is this, hello? What you mean my turn, hello? It's an unknown call, Who is this? <laughs> I had a funeral down south, because I'm from Chicago, we had to go to Mississippi. My grandmother don't want to fly. She's one of those old people who don't like to get on planes. So she's somebody to ride on the Greyhound bus with her. They called me up, could you ride with your grandmother? Look, this your mama, fam. She my grandmother. <laughs> this your mama. <laughs> that bus ride was the same, man. Was like, first of all, that bus has a smell to it now, because everybody bring their own food. I warn you, real quick, if you ever on a Greyhound again, just bring your own food. Don't, don't go get the rest stop food. You stop everybody on the bus. I walked into that four-piece nugget, everybody stopped eating their sandwiches, like, oh, wait a minute. <laughs> wait a minute. <laughs> Who's the billionaire with the four-piece? <laughs> they all stopped eating their leftover sandwiches. Who, who is that? <laughs> he looked at me, look here, brother. I know you only got a four-piece. Let me get a dip. Wait, wait a minute. <laughs> He tried to dip his sandwich in my sweet sour sauce. Look, come on, let me get a dip. At least let me lick the flap. I saw you put it back in the bag. Let me lick the flap. Let me lick the flap and get a dip. Don't be killed. You ain't doing nothing with it. We get there. Family see me. They proud of me. Which is good. You know, you want your family to be proud of you, you know. But I hate family like that hate on other family to say something nice about you. That ain't right. You know what I mean? Like, oh, <laughs> my cousin Keisha, her dad was mean about it. Like, oh man, look at you. Big time here, y'all, look at him. <laughs> Killing it, man. You know why? Cause you listen. I'm like, you ain't never told me nothing. I just met you this week. <laughs> like, you listen, you know what I'm saying? Not like your cousin Keisha, she don't know what she got going on. And I'm like, oh, come on, brother, you can't do that. And my cousin Keisha, she wanted, you know, she's one of these girls, she's ghetto. <laughs> She's like, Daddy, you don't know me. You ain't never been in my life. How you know what I'm doing? So it turned into this whole argument that was way too personal, right? You're like, I ain't supposed to be here for this. You know what I'm saying? You don't know, I got a new wife. Leave me alone. Your new wife, ugly as hell. Like, whoa, wait a minute. Can I leave before? <laughs> now she's mad at me the whole time. She start bragging to me what she got going on. She's like, cuz I'm good. Don't listen to my lame ass daddy. You know what I'm saying? A bitch good, got my CNA license, yep, doing it, good. She started bragging about it, yeah, I got, I'm gonna be on IVs. I'm gonna get some schmucks, I'm gonna have a lunch break. Wait, you bragging about regular shit, that's what, I'm gonna have a break. You should, I think legally. Legally, they're supposed to get that, I think. <laughs> Y'all laughing, see, that's, that's who your caretaker is. Everybody taking care of your people, that's who it is. <laughs> These ghetto ass CNA nurses. Mean as hell to your grandfather. <laughs> He's sick. He just shitted on himself. Feel terrible. She ain't supposed to say nothing. She's supposed to just change him and leave him alone. Be nice to him. She just get out of here. Ugh, damn, you're stinking ass. <laughs> damn, Mr. James, why you dust your dirty as hell? You shitted on yourself again? <laughs> you damn right I did. I'm sick, goddammit. You ain't supposed to be talking to me like that. They didn't take all that money out of my check for this shit. She be leaving them in a tub. <laughs> Hello, I'm finished. Hello. Keisha, goddammit, hey. Hello. I'm finished. She on her cell phone. Yeah, I'm at work getting it in. She on Snapchat at work getting money. You look at our Snapchat here in the back room. Hello, anybody out there? It's the Snap, whatever it is, please help me, please. My address is 144, 64 Riverside, help, help. Room 303. <laughs> here in the background of her Snap. This is in the bathroom. <laughs> Hello? 
Hey, y'all, thank y'all so much. I'm